The joys of the season often distract many people from thinking of health issues like exercise, diabetes, cholesterol and hypertension. In light of this, Senior Medical Officer with Responsibility for Chronic Diseases in the Ministry of Health, Dr. Sonia Nixon, is appealing to everyone to make healthy choices to avoid regrets in January. The ministry wants to see everybody have a wonderful time, but let's be moderate about it, okay? Let's be moderate about the consumption of sugary foods, you know, the fruit cake and the... Uh, eggnog and the rum punch and the sorrel and the ginger beer and the mobby and all the things that are so Grenadian that are so fabulous and wonderful and taste so good and we know how sugar tastes nice but the truth is we kind of need to do everything in moderation we need to watch how much fats remember the big roast pork leg and the, and, and, and the crab back and the you name it the foods that are highly fatty the cakes right um, we have to be very careful. Dr. Nixon says although maintaining a healthy lifestyle around the holidays may be challenging, following a few simple guidelines can keep you healthy. What do you do? Well, smaller portions. You like fruitcake? So do I. But I'm not eating the whole cake. You like ham? But you don't have to eat the whole pork leg. You know, and the salt. We know that the hams that we get are very salty. Have a little piece today. Have some more tomorrow. There is, you have two weeks to eat all that food. Okay, so have a little. Dr. Nixon warns about starchy foods and alcohol that are usually in abundance around this time of year. The macaroni and cheese, fatty and or diabetics really should indulge in, in stuff like that where you have um, a lot of, we have bleached flour and a lot of sugar and a lot of fat, right? Because those foods really make a sugar shoot up. So we like the big macaroni pie and all this stuff. Have a little bit. It doesn't matter. Have a little bit today, have a little tomorrow, and you, and you can enjoy. Um, alcohol also is usually a little prevalent around that time. There's just a whole lot of alcoholic drinks. But alcohol is pure sugar. So we want to make sure that people are very moderate. Joseph McKee-Smith, GBN News.